give them a try in, in more time. I see. We, we've lost one, one of our own in Kumasi, the actor Tutu. News came in yesterday that he had passed on. And then his mom, in an interview, said before he passed on, he mentioned that he believed he had been bewitched or something like that. And yesterday, Fifi Coleman, well, Fifi is one of us now, Fifi mentioned that Juju, in the, we were discussing, so in the movie industry, well, it seems real. Well, no, I don't want you to prosper. I don't want you to go for... Have you had any experience like that? Yeah, yeah. Um, I, I, I'm I, saying yes, because the, the only remedy for what happened that time was prayers. You know, I went to the hospital and it was just not working. Mm. It was on the set of Material Girl with... Uh, yeah. And it was kind of like the movie. It, I was the only, you know, female face in that movie. And I remember that someone told me that, hey, do you know that if this movie doesn't do well, um, Salam, the producer, will not cast you again. So it was, a, it was a blow. Like, I felt the pressure. I went on set and my eye was, um, it was swelling. It was getting red. The, my lens. Mm. Oh, is it cornea? Or mm. what do you call it? Anyways, yeah. Uh, so it was getting, there was this ring that was forming around it. It was getting worse. My eye was getting, like, I felt like it was rotting, you know. Uh, we went to the hospital. They gave me, like, an ointment. I used it. It wasn't working. We went back. And the doctor was like, ah, but it's just a bacterial or viral infection or something. Charlie, that thing wasn't working when I was shooting. So if you watch Material Girl, you'd realize that in most of my scenes, I had sunglasses on. Mm. But Salam could not wait. I had to, you know. Um, so there was this day I went, Charlie, that one, they could not do anything because there's no way you're in your bed wearing sunglasses, mm. right? So they gave me two days off and I did something. I fasted and prayed and after two days, it actually cleared. Wow. Yeah, yeah, it did. It, like, it was like magic. It, it was, I was crying. I remember I was crying. I was lying flat on the floor. I was crying and praying, crying and praying. I locked myself up in the room and it worked work so prayer does work did you contact any or so for i was actually suspecting someone <laughs> yeah, i did i mean i can't mention names i can't mention names but um you you should be discerning to know you know who and who and who doesn't want you in in that space and um when i came into the industry a, a lot of my colleagues and people i, I used to hear things like now and also taben or bai you know um even from people who smile with me now and they were not happy <laughs> that I was, you know, I was there. So yeah, I believe in it. I believe there's like a force, a spiritual something that goes on behind. Jackie, do you do you believe it? Oh yeah, because it's not just happening in the creative industry, even in churches. I thought you'd be hard girl. <laughs> 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 yeah, because looking at you, I said, "Baby, show me your sick yeah, you be hard girl. I see you to be very hard. Oh, yeah, sometimes yeah, I, I watch your skits. So yeah, like, sometimes I'm hard. Sometimes I'm hard, but you never really know a person until you get close. But have you had any experience like that? Yeah, that's what I'm saying in church. In church? Yeah, even in church. In church? Yeah. Tell me about it. <laughs> no, but that's very interesting. In church? Yeah, it happened like a long time. I don't know if they saw something, but then um, I used to be part of the choir. So then I think it was, um, they were sharing something, malt, and then meat pie oh the malt i didn't know that they had opened it oh. but then it looked like it was already sealed so when i took it in 30 minutes i was home like i was sick my stomach wow yeah they put something in it if you see a tell me you must be careful lord of mercy Hmm. <laughs> but I was advised on set that on a particular set not to eat the food they yeah. they serve. But like uh, someone but just pulled me aside, like an older person who was on the set for a very long time pulled me aside and told me that look, if you can afford it, I bring know. your own food. Do not eat the food on the set. Hmm. But it might happen in church, I mean. In church? <laughs> yeah. where, where, people. where it's supposed to be kosher. Yeah. Supposed to be sacred. And... Charlie. <laughs> Eddie. <laughs> it's something else. Okay. So, on Saturday, 7 p.m., Silverbird Cinemas, West Hills Mall. How much are we paying? Only 50 cities. Only? 50-50. 50-50. 
50 50. Yeah. You know, there's an old movie like that. Yeah. Yeah, 50 50. 50 50. Yeah. YN Productions. Oh, this is a different production? Yeah. YN Productions. Oh, YN. Okay. Well, let me read some comments. OG Wangana says, Ghana, dear Juju, in everything from football to movie, everything. <laughs> <laughs> and you. Hey. 